promised to do it to me. I'm here just getting off work. And it's, uh, let's see if y'all can see that. Oh, Facebook popped up. My bad. Somewhere up there at the top, y'all can see. Yeah. So it's about to be 4 o'clock. But I'm so excited because I'm in the garage. I know y'all asked for the, the update with the 6-4, right? Guess what? Tomorrow, I'm dropping that bad baby off to get. Uh, oh, yeah. This bad boy about to get uh, rewired. Complete harness. Uh, wire harness from the, uh, I'm going to say from the tail light. From the headlights to the tail lights, my bad. Bear with me. It's four in the morning. I just banged out about eleven hours at work. So I'm a little tired. But I want to show y'all this boy because I spent that guap. A lot of noise. All right. Here we go. I'm in the garage. Classic industry. Cars one. That's where I get all my parts from. Let me, let me try to set y'all up real quick. I didn't think about this. So this is literally the big, big boy, big boy box. Updated. Let me see if it, if it said on here. Okay, definitely. So the classic updated. Wire set, of course, for the 6164 Impala. So, if you know, uh, let me see, we got the actual, it's actually a big box. Man. There's a lot of stuff in here. A lot. I just need to get to the main circuit show. Uh, this look good too. They got everything labeled, the engine kit. Okay, here we go right here. Let's see. Okay, cursor. Cursor lights, the headlight switch. That can be everything. Alternator main power. Just the headlights. Gotta be there. This one. Okay, the trunk lid harness. Oh, here we go, right here. So, this one I'm pretty much updating to. Right there, the fuse panel. So, I actually put the fuse in it. Because right now, in my 6.4, it's the old school. Like, the um, the bulbs, little fuse. So, I just, okay. I'm updating them to these. You know what I'm saying? Where it's plugged in instead of the old school. Liquid kind. I don't got one of those, so example. But yeah, so this is it. This is it. And if you wonder where I got miles from, I got miles from. Um, I actually got this from Cars One. So the updated kit was pretty much about seven hundred dollars. So it's a pretty good penny, but still, it's something I would recommend. Especially if you uh you doing your car. So I'm redoing everything. I mean on my car I'm touching every bolt, every whatever. So I recommend doing that for sure. That way you will know everything is A1. And while I'm at it, man, I just had it. I was behind me. I bought this old old school radio and well it was it's not an old school radio but i had bought this power acoustics i know y'all remember the radios with the dvd built in so as of right now i'm gonna put it in there but not in the actual dash i got a little uh, mount adapter that i'm gonna mount it up under the dash so towards the middle of the console i'm hoping it it will uh, come out and look right because if it don't i mean it wouldn't make no 
sense to put that in there with it got the built-in little screen so man it's just a quick update like i said i just got off work i'm just excited um that i'm getting this done because if you've seen my previous video or the one before that i was saying there's two things that i really want done this year wiring the car and getting it painted so the time is here to get it wired up so hopefully we can squeeze in the paint paint job before this year is up and i will feel i mean it's here so what i'm gonna do tomorrow i'm gonna um i'm gonna charge up my gopros and i'm gonna record it, uh the video of me taking the 64 to him because he stay up the street so he ain't that far and then do another video on that and hopefully um i'm gonna ask him you know hopefully i can record him if he start on it right away because he's funny that dude is stupid funny, y'all. Y'all gotta, I'm gonna get some clips of it. Cause he, he be saying some stuff. But all right, man, this was another super quick update. It's time for me to get in the shower, get in the bed. But hey, continue to hit that like, subscribe, ask questions, whatever you wanna know, I got you. Um, and if y'all new, go watch the um, previous video. That's gonna pop up on the end for a chance to win 500 at the end of October. So, man, good luck. And I'll holla at y'all. YouTube, good morning. What it do is your boy, Mr. Do a Tune, Two Lakes, all he did a tune. Yeah, it's a uh, good early Sunday morning. Everybody's still asleep. Y'all see what I'm about to do. Yeah. Your boy running off a few hours of sleep. I just got off. But I got my baby out, let it warm up. So, what I'm about to do right now is I'm about to take the 6-4, drop it off for a good start to uh, the wiring process. So I'm uh, the video I made last night when I got off, I'm going uh, to add that in here. But I pretty much showed my wire kit, which is right here. The complete updated wire kit. Um, I got a radio. Even though they put one in there, that's coming out. I'm going to put the original one in there. But I'm going to see if I can uh, have fun to wire that up. So I got my uh, GoPro charging because I'm going to get the footage of me driving it to him. And uh, yeah, hopefully uh, he uh, let me record him because he's a funny guy. Real funny. And I'm going to record him, see what he's talking about. I'm sure he's going to be talking hella, hella stuff. You know what I'm saying? So all right, man, stay tuned. Hope y'all enjoy the video. All right, too. I'm all packed up. Got the GoPro set up. I don't know how this is gonna work out, but my suction is not sticking to nothing. So I got them. I'm gonna put the head GoPro on. Let me go go ahead and get this footage. Drive to his house. So y'all know the boy ain't got no windshield, so uh <laughs> definitely need the safety glasses on feel. Well, all right man, we out.